Brethren, my name is Mr. Godi Oseji. I'm from Delta State, but I reside here at LA2. What brought me here? I came here like that is the first day of this program. It's my first time of entering this church. And when I was invited, there are problems that I have. For about two months ago, a brother called me because he has my number that he wants to do a job concerning my feet. I said, okay, after we discuss, at almost like 10 to 11 the night, I said, okay, we did not conclude the price. It didn't work out. Early morning, he asked me, can you go on with the price? I said to you, I said, no. Later, I just called him back. Said, for somebody to remember me, and even if I go shop that day, I don't think I have anything to do. For me to go there and sit down, let me just call this man and do the job for him. Then I called him. He gave me part of the money. I started this job. We, we agreed on two weeks. Within the own side of the work, I did my own part. And I have other part that I'm supposed to give somebody else to join me to work. We scheduled on Thursday so that they can work on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We collect the work. Reaching on Thursday, this guy did not come. And I finished what I'm doing. I still have other jobs that I'm doing. There's no chance for me to lay my hands on that job. Friday, this guy came. And I told him, I said, okay, please, I've paid somebody 8,000 naira to do this particular job for me. But for now, now the one I have at hand, I could not be able to meet up and do the same, this one. Please, if this guy cannot come tomorrow being uh, Saturday, by on Monday, I will try. At least Monday, Tuesday to Wednesday, I will finish up the job. This guy just turned back that he will not collect this job again. I shall refund this money. Give me from that date on the 6th of last month uh, i said why now i pleaded with him he could not even listen to me i said okay no problem so within then i was thinking okay before then go help me i'll sell it no no business everywhere look like everywhere dried i went to help one of my friends to do something for Igbeche. i think on monday within that period then i finished the work already because sorry i forgot to make I forgot to make mention of that. So on Monday, I start the same this job. I did it on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, I finished the job. I called this guy. This guy said I should not call him. That should refund this money. He has already bought another of that same job. I pleaded with him to bear with me because of the condition. He could not listen to me. And this man is a soldier man. So I don't know what else to say. I said, okay, no problem. So what happened? That on Monday, I was there. One of my friends, close friend, we are working together, just called me that this same guy come to my shop oh, and he has re arrested my boy. They have locked my shop. Oh. I said, ah, why now? This guy is my friend. We have known this guy for almost five years. So what kind of problem will I have? This guy he cannot even listen to me just like this. I've worked for him one, two, three times. What does it mean? I was thinking it's a joke. After the old story, this guy called me on his own phone. I said, ah, he never reached this kind of time, uh, uh, action now. Even if you don't know, want the job, as you said, give me time for me to say. He said, I should come to Abajo police station so that he will leave my boy and hold me. I said, okay, no problem. I went to Abajo. Before I get there, he called me again. I should wait for a junction. I said, okay, no problem. Reaching there, me and my friend, we get there. He asked my boy to come down. I should enter car. Two army, one for back, one for this side. I enter the center. He about to move up. The other, my friend say, he knew much about this job. And I have extended arm because of one or two things that happened. That is why I could not meet up. He should give me time for me to give him this money. He said, you don't want, want to listen. That when I get to barrack, I will look for means. People will look for money to come and pay me there. I said, okay. I didn't even say anything. For me to explain this one, I said, shh, save your energy. Don't say anything. I said, okay, no problem. I enter inside the car. Before one or two things, he asked me, when are you be able to pay this money? I said, for now, I don't have money on my hand. But give me two weeks. I believe before then, anything come out, I will pay you. He said, two weeks, okay. Two weeks, okay. It's okay. The other guy said, let him be. It's okay. I should come down. Reaching my shop, I said, what will I do for me to get this money? This money is 80,000 naira for two weeks. I said, no. So from this problem, I not feel sleep. Me and my children just they live with tears. For me to eat again, rope, I don't even know what to do. 
I know even no kind of job for me to do to raise that money. I called him again. He said, I should not call this number again. That, that two weeks, if I not bring this money, anything I say, I should take it. You know, that kind of ways of threatening would kind of add words on me. I said, okay, no problem. So when I was invited to this place, I came here. I never come to this church for any reason. This, that day was my first day. That was the first day of this program. When I enter here, I just asked. I didn't come to see anybody. If really God is here, I must share my testimony before I leave this program. I said it with confidence and I enter here. I dropped just 200 naira. I drop it here. I hold my hand here. After saying the word, I ask God, whether it's from that job or any means, but that particular job, I don't want to see this job at the end of this three days program. I just said it confidently, fully like if I know what is going to happen. Brethren, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Just one encounter, and I'm out of counter. I never believe that this is how God works in this place. <laughs> that same job, before that, before yesterday, somebody came to my shop and offered me a job that I could be able to even raise at least a little of it. I said, okay. I know you will never fail me. My name is God Day. At least a leader, a lead by example. You cannot have this kind of name and they use me to this kind of word. I used that. I kept that. yesterday around almost seven to seven thirty. I've closed already. This guy come was in hurry. I said, No, guy, to, tomorrow there is no time. He said, No, no, no. I saw this chair the other day. I want to buy this chair. Did this and that. I was thinking, I said, What? I said, I don't know. I don't. I was just a long time feeling like maybe one of those guys that normally come. Before you know, this guy paid the chair exactly. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. And I said that if that chair will be sold, so I will come here and give God 5,000. I'm not saying that is a tithe, but I'm giving God that. Praise Master Jesus. Your testimony is permanent in Jesus' name. My name is Charity Emenike. I've been hearing of this uh, mountain of fire element. So on March, I came to this place for the first time, March this year. You know, when a man of God was praying, he released a word of knowledge that there is somebody here. You are having a spirit of devourer. And that spirit of devourer is because of your mother. So that you cannot take care of your aged mother. You know, I knew what I was passing through. That when I received salary, before I would say, Jack, the money is finished. And I cannot send anything to my mother. I was praying. As I was praying, he said again, you have five brethren. The same thing is happening to them. And I have five brothers. I prayed. When, I, when the program ended, I went home. I called all of them. Look at the revelation that came up. You people should come to Port Come to Port Harcourt so that we go to Mountain of Fire and pray. Two of them came and we prayed. On that April, on that April, God really visited us. And now I can send money to my mother. I thank God in the name of Jesus. As I came for that April on, a word of knowledge came up again on my head. I said, there is a woman here. Your seat in the office is being dragged front and back, front and back. And I knew that my place of work I'm a teacher. They just instituted a new board of governing council. And they said they want to revamp this, manage the school. And they will change management, change everything. 
I pray that say God secure my seat. So when that word of knowledge came up, I prayed and I claimed and said, my position, my seat, nobody will take. Hallelujah. In that April, the board chairman called the PTA chairman and told him that they are going to change management. And the PTA chairman asked him, is it going to affect MNK? He said, yes. MNK will be sent to a classroom and another person will man the office. The man called me and told me. I said, God, the defender of the widow and the poor, defend me. I don't know where they will raise this case. But God, I know you will speak for me. My position cannot be taken. I prayed. I said, I stand upon the word of knowledge your servant released. And I said, take it from me. And lo and behold, by the time we close for the July, the list came out. I am still in my office. I said to God, be all the glory in the name of Jesus. So this month, last month, July, at that day we came and we went home with water. On 16th of July, my son called me and said, Mommy, around 9 o'clock, say, Mommy, pray for me. I don't know what is happening to me. I don't even know what to pray. I said, Holy Spirit, take control. Around 11.30, he called the younger sister and said, Obi, pray for me with a very low tune. Pray for me. Pray for me. And so we were worried and we prayed. Early morning on that Wednesday, 17th, I rushed to his house. And I found him lying helpless on the bed. We prayed. He could not stand up. He could not sit. The younger brother that went with me, we just stood him beside me. And they put on his trouser and his shirt. We called boat and carried him into the boat. As we were going in, I said, rush to health center close to me at Rumi Bo. Before we got to Rumibo, a psychiatric hospital road, my son gave up. He died. And I rushed him. I was shouting, God, I knew the promise you gave me when their father died in Jeremiah 49, 11. You said, leave the fatherless. I will preserve them alive. I keep on shouting that. I said, you will not die. You will live. We, I was praying when we got to the hospital, we carried him and they helped us to the bed. The nurses and people said, he is already gone. I said, no, my son will not go. He will live again. I was shouting, calling friends. They were praying with me. He was we were praying. That younger sister said, mommy, when I was coming, the spirit led in me and said, go back and carry that manna water. Put in a bag. Water. I don't even know what to do. I said, Holy Spirit, what do I do with the manna water? I opened his mouth, we poured the water. The water just poured out. I said, okay, I carry the water. Blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. I was just sprinkling the water on his face. Blood of Jesus. As I was sprinkling the water, my son opened his eye. The doctors, the nurses. Hey. Oh, Jesus. My son came back to life. And they were trying to look for the vein. To put a drip. The vein collapsed. They cannot. But one thing I know that my son has came back to life. And they said, take him to a government hospital. And we got to the government hospital. They checked him just to bring a little blood and test and know the problem. The blood cannot come out. I said, God, make the blood came, come out. And the blood came out. They tested it. They said it's hypoglycemia. Very low sugar. That's what happened. And God was able to make the event come up. 
They put the drip. The same day we came back home. The following day he went to work. To God be all the glory in the name of Jesus. Your testimony is permanent in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. My name is Derebo Savo. I was here in the month of May. That May, before I came to this place, I was displaced because of a, I was displaced because money that I was expecting to pay my rent. It was not forthcoming. It was always promise and fail. The jobs I did, no payment. Now, unfortunately, they called me before then that part of the money is ready. I said they should pay it and I called my landlady that I will give her the money. The people that called me with their own hands that the money was ready that April. I waited for a lot. A lot was not forthcoming. So the next thing was, she said she has exhausted that patient, so I have to pack. That's May I was here and I fell under anointing here and deliverance was carried out on me. By the grace of God, when I got home that very May. My brother called me and he said, do you know that the place where you live, you've, since you've been living there, there is no tangible achievement. And I remember that since I traveled out from 2015, I came back, I've not experienced any tangible achievement in that place since I returned back from that 2016. So when he told me that, I said, that registered something to me. Oh, that maybe if, when you change, there will be change, good things will follow you. And it touched me. Lo and behold, after that deliverance, the money that I was expecting came and I packed into a new place. I just want to return thanks unto God. Your testimony is permanent in Jesus' name. Beloved, for that one encounter that gets a brother out of the encounter, for that testimony of restoration back to life, and many more that the Lord has done for us in this program, no, oh, please be on our feet and return all the praise, all the thanks, all the honor unto God with three powerful shout of hallelujah. 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 You will lift up a voice and crown light and clear. Say, wicked altars. Wicked altars. That have vowed not to let me go. Tonight, let me go. Amen. Amen. Please be on your feet if you're sitting down. Tonight, every altar that have vowed not to let you go, they either let you go or to let you rest. I say tonight, altar that have vowed not to let you go, it's either they let you go or they will let you rest. Is it that they let you go or they'll be let to raise? Are you ready? Say, wicked altars. Wicked altars. Thou vow not to let me go. Tonight, let me go. 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 For in Jesus' name we pray. Say ancient altars in my father's house. Your voice is very low. Say ancient altars in my father's house. Time in that response. Collapse. Amen. 
the aggression with which we are attacking this prayer point is very, very low. Altars are something that have been erected several years ago. And so you cannot be praying gently and expect the altar to collapse. But the altar to collapse means that an appreciable force needed to be exerted upon that altar for it to be collapsed. So that appreciable force has to come by you putting more effort in your prayer. Are you ready? Say, ancient altars in my father's house. Your voice is very low. Say, ancient altars in my father's house. Tie me down to sport. Collapse by fire. Collapse, 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 collapse. Collapse, 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 collapse. Altar collapse. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Oh yeah, bass, 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 bass. Oh yeah, bass, 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 bass. It's time, it's time. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Shake up, shake up, shake up, shake up. Oh yeah, begin to shake up, begin to shake up. Yes, 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 yes. Shake up, shake up, shake up. Shake up, shake up, shake up. Shake your legs, shake your hands. Say every spirit of dullness, every spirit of weakness. Catch my, 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 catch my. Yes, yes, yes. Open your mouth and declare. Open your mouth and declare it. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Please stretch out your hands this way, ladies. Hold yourself. Hold yourselves. Join. Lock up your hands. Quickly, quickly, no time. No time. Lock your hands ahead. You are going to declare like this. Say, any wicked halter that has formed a hedge against my destiny, say, no way. I break loose my fire. At this point, lose yourself violently. Leave yourselves and begin to break it. Amen. Say, any wicked altar that have form a hedge against my destiny. You are a liar. I break all my fire. Yeah, break it, break it, break it. Break the hedge. Break the hedge. Yes, 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 yes. Break the hedge, break the hedge. Break, 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 break. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Well, put your mouth and break it. Break, 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 break. Yes, 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 yes. Break, 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 break. Well, put your mouth on the clients. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Say, altars of my father's house. Altars of my father's house. Altars of my father's house. Altars of my mother's house. Altars of my mother's house. Altars of my mother's house. It's time for you to let me go. Let me go. In the name of your pure mother, declare yes, 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 yes. Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go. Let me go, 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 let me go. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, 
yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, Mighty name, we pray. Don't walk away. Remember where you are. We are going to shout this one. Say, Family altar that removed my original image and put the image of an old man upon me. You are a liar. Scatter. Open your mouth and shout it. Scatter, 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 scatter. Yes, 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 yes. Open your mouth and neglect. Scatter, 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 scatter. Scatter, 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 scatter. Command them to scatter. Command them to scatter. Command them to scatter. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Don't go back to your seat. Just stay where you are. Before I continue with the prayer, please, I want everybody to listen to this announcement. From now, henceforth, this information is from our Father in the Lord, Pastor Shoes. From now, henceforth, when we finish program, don't come to this altar and say you want to pray. Many people, they are coming here to come and pray. They are stealing money from the altar. I caught one today. They told me, and I said, you should not worry. I will catch her. And I caught her. So, from now, pastor said, I should tell you, when you finish your prayer, go and sleep. Don't come to the altar and pray. You have prayed enough, and God has answered your prayer. I say, God has answered your prayer. Amen. 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 Say, altars of my father's house. Altars of my mother's house. Assigned to swallow virtue. I am not your candidate. Say, altars of my father's house. Altars of my mother's house. Assigned to swallow virtues. I am not your candidate. What are you waiting for? Da 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 in Jesus mighty name dear dear in Jesus' mighty name, they are there. Say any altar behind my battle, your hand has come. Say any altar behind my battle, you are a liar. Da, 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 da. Any altar that is behind my battle. You are a liar. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. 
John, 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 in Jesus' mighty name, they are there. In Jesus' mighty name, they are there. Say, altars of my father's house. Altars of my mother's house. Assigned to swallow my money. You are a liar. Altars of my father's house. Altars of my mother's house. Altars in my village are sent to swallow my money. You are a liar. Da 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 any altar assigned to swallow any good things in your life. They must die. Die, 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 die. Yes. Yes. That altar must die. Die, 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 die. Da 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 In Jesus mighty name we pray Beloved you are going to share the blood of Jesus three times before we go to this battle Are you ready You share the blood of Jesus because the Bible say we overcame by the blood of the Lamb. Are you ready? Want to go? Blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Now you bother like this. Say, any evil altar. Drinking blood in my father's house. By the sacrifice in the blood of Jesus. I come against you tonight. Dear, dear. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes! You don't order we come against you! Evil order in my father's house! Drinking blood! We come against you! By the sacrifice in the blood of Jesus! see angry in you. Those altars is the altar they are giving blood to run after somebody. They demand blood. They demand human sacrifice. They sacrifice them to push a person, to put them person in problem. Please, I want you to pray that prayer very well. Shout it very well. Say, evil altar in my father's house. Evil altar in my mother's house that is drinking blood. My blood is not your candidate. By the sacrifice in the blood of Jesus, I come against you tonight. God, fire, 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 God,
He, Jesus, mighty name we pray. Say, who is standing before evil order? Measuring my name for death. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Father. I decree upon your life, whoever calling your name in any evil order for death tonight, they will go down and die in the name of Jesus. Who is standing? At, who is standing before evil order? Calling my name for untimely death, for sorrow. For this grace tonight, we are ever you are. name we pray a louder amen shout your loudest amen every altar troubling my life my family must catch fire tonight a louder amen help me to tell your neighbor say neighbor I can't hear you say neighbor you will not come this program in vain say whether the devil like it or not after this program your life will change say amen like a believer amen. talk to another neighbor say neighbor amen. hear me and hear me very well after this program whether you like it or not you are alive say you are alive we make progress if you be that say a loud amen. amen. Beloved, before we fire down, I want us to give God 10 minutes dance. Honomu juru nekele. Anyway, honomu juru nekele. Ono monjuru nekele Ome tobi mo Ono monjuru Oni mane me ma Ono me kele ki wo Oya ne me ma Hebi me le Do follow mo Ono monjuru nekele Uta ba wari ni Ono me kele ki wo Ono monjuru Oya ne me ma Hebi me le Do follow mo Ono monjuru Every 
order. To you, to you, to you, to you. Be order glory. And order show for forever. Father, to you, to you, to you.
Jesus. Kekele derekio. Yale ya machine pe na merebo. Yes Jesus. What is that? Oh, biale biale. Yale ya machine pe na merebo. Are you sure? Yes Jesus. What is that?
Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hada. Hoya. 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 Hallelujah. Hoya. Hallelujah. Hoya. Hallelujah. Hoya. Hallelujah. Hoya. Hallelujah. Shake your body to my minute. Second. Be second. Second. Be second. Second. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hoya. 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 If you refuse to shake your body, if I come, 
Hallelujah. If you are ready for tonight, oppression, bury them and forget them. Oppression, shout a loud hallelujah. Stand on your feet. One shout before you sit down. You are going to shout my father's altar. God's fire. My. The way some of you are looking as if you are working in the bank. Hey, I lost. Don't, don't be looking too gentle in the place of prayer. Amen. Hear me? If your eye is not red, I used to tell people, it's either you be smoking a bow or you must have money or your eye must be very red in the red of the spirit. If not, nobody go fear you. You see how this you are? That's why they depress you. When you are sleeping, you should be breathing in and out fire the oxide. So that when they near you, they will report back to their cover that they made a mistake. Listen to me, sir. A boy, a very young guy made a very big contract in Abuja. Return back. You know, we that are from this part of the world, I do too much. Everywhere, I do, I do, I do, I do. That is how that boy made money. The same day, they approved that job for him in Abuja. He received a call from his uncle, who never called him for six years. The man was crying. Hey, you escape. You escape. You escape. I am praying for you. Your enemy will make mistake tonight. And that mistake will lead to your escape in the name of Jesus. You are not shouting amen. No. Let your amen roll like thunder. Let your amen carry anointing. I want to say one or two things before we begin to pray. But before you sit down, you are going to shout, fire of God, locate my father's altar. Fire of God, locate my father's altar. Fire of God, locate my father's Are you ready? Some prayer points I'm going to call this night. You may, some of you, you know, there are some of you, you are not used to MFM prayer. So at times when you hear some prayer points, you're going to ask yourself, which can prayer be this now? Which can prayer be this? Huh? Pray it anyhow. Raise your voice. You will scream it seven times. Say, fire of God! Look at my father's order! hearing your voice. Listen to me, sir. I have seen a pastor that pastored the church for 12 years and went back and become a native doctor. Married for wife. Pastor, after 12 years in ministry, a pastor in Assemblies of God Church draw Bible, go back to his father's idol, marry four wives, and a native doctor. You will not end like that in Jesus' name. So, not they do say nothing to happen. No, something day. If something that is stronger than you hits you, if God is not on your side, you will go down. You will not go down in Jesus' name. Please raise your voice, not and say, Fire of God! Look at my father's order! Are you ready now? One, two, go, let's go! If you are here this night and 
you cannot pick your phone when you are in need of 500,000 or a million naira and call somebody from your family and they will send the money for you the same day your family need deliverance it means if you commit a crime God forbid of 1 million you go to prison someone say God forbid the prayer you are going to pray here tonight it will reach you it will reach your family member it will reach your children can you say amen like a believer you are going to shout say ancient altar of my father's house that has swallowed my family prosperity hear the word of the Lord you will be shouting
your leg up. Carry your leg up. Carry your leg up. Carry your leg up. Carry your You're not opening your mouth. Too. Carry your leg up. Carry your leg up. Carry your leg. Match your leg on the ground. You are sitting down, B. You are sitting down. Carry your leg. 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 Carry your leg.
Jesus name pray those of you that are not praying I wonder what your plan is I wonder what your plan is you are going to scream at the top of your voice marine altar release my star the angel have landed now please if you are sitting down I beg you to stand on your feet please stand on your feet say Mary Lata! release my star they are about to be commotion inside one river inside one river a serious commotion commotion close your eyes close your eyes please let's pray you will raise your voice say Mary Lata!
what is it? All your property inside the water, you will shut fire seven times. Holy God! 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 That is it. Any altar dragging your glory with you.
this sister. You are not praying, no. You are not praying, no. Bless 
sister. God bless you, my brother. I love this address. Uh, 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 uh,
Jesus now pray. <laughs> this next prayer. This next prayer. As you pray this next prayer, some of you you will dream tonight. An angel of God will come with anointing oil and place it on your hand. wake up you will confirm that something has happened to you God said we should ask for every oil that has stolen from us let them return it so you are going to shout say my stolen oil come back to my head you can sit down and pray this kind prayer say my stolen oil My stolen eye. Come back to my head. Please close your eyes. Don't stop until you, 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 you. I ask you to do so. Are you ready? My stolen eye. Come back to my head. My stolen eye. Come back to my head. My stolen eye. Come back to my head. A sister is here. The python that have been coming to. Harass you in the dream. God said, I should tell you, that python is dead forever. In the name of Jesus. in Jesus name let your voice swallow that of your neighbor my stolen oil come back to my head my stolen oil come back to my head that is I, I want you to shout it until something drop on your head are you ready one two go let's go let's have us
Jesus now pray. Lift up your two hands. Close your eyes. 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 That's the angel. That's the angel. That's the angel of God. 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 Look at the angel standing in right front of his sister. See the angel. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Who tamper with your oil of glory? Ah, it's happening. Oh yeah. Return it now. Who touched your head when you were a little baby? Who touched your head? Who used them to touch your head? Who used them to touch your head? Who used them to touch your head? Who used them? Holy Ghost! Lift hands! That is it! That is it! Oh my God! Who used witchcraft hand? To wipe your head. Who use witchcraft hand to wipe away what will make you great? Why return it in the name of Jesus? Thank you, my father. Thank you, my father. Thank you, my father. Please, what I want you to do now, do it very well. I see somebody, some people carry something that is not supposed to be in the head of every normal human being. You can't carry stone in your head and go far. You cannot carry coffee and you will not dream seeing yourself eating with dead people. Say every evil load on my head. I shake you off. Can you, can you say every evil load? Shout it louder than that. Shout it with every strength you can gather. On my head, I shake you off. I shake you off. I shake you off. I shake you off. Shake that head vigorously. Shake that head vigorously. Sister, you see, you are sitting down. Shake your head vigorously. Shake that. Shake that. Shake that. Every stone they put on your head. Let that stone go back to center. Go back. Go back. Shake your head. Shake it. 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 Shake that head vigorously. Sister, shake your head. Let me pray for you. Any evil load placed upon your head by the wicked elders of the father's house. I command that evil load. Go back to send in the name of Jesus. If I 
I say, honor of evil Lord. I want you to scream, carry your Lord, carry your Lord, carry your Lord, carry your Lord, seven times. Are you ready? Honor of evil Lord in your head. Before you sit down, say, 
by the grace of God, that next section, pastor is going to be around. Put your hand together for Jesus. Are you clapping for Jesus? Praise the name of the Lord. If you have not written your own, I said, any altar you can remember in your family, in your community, in the environment where you stay, put them down. God, write their names down. If you don't know their name, I give you the privilege to call and ask questions. Praise the name of the Lord. Beloved, this program is exactly what God asked Gideon to do. God asked Gideon to put down his father's altar so that his life can make progress. And those of you that are here, I want to say congratulations. Are you saying amen? Congratulations. Ah, somebody's not talking. Congratulations. Because you are going to live to remember this month of September. Praise the name of the Lord. You are going to live to remember what? This month of September. You will see what God will do in your life. Say amen like a believer. In case you have given up, you have given up hope. In case you have already forget this year, please don't do yourself such injustice. The year is still very fresh. As long as I'm concerned, the year is still very fresh. Anything can still happen. One day is too much for God to change your story and turn your lamentation to laughter. If you say amen, may God change your story. Let your amen be louder. The almighty God will change your story. In the mighty name of Jesus. We have some few sections to go. An instruction from pastor. After the morning section, immediately after poor more changes, we are going to have more, another section that will last for one hour by the grace of God. Then I will now release you to go. The next section is going to be VG at p.m. in the night. If you are here, if, if, you, are, if you are planning to run away, shout hallelujah. Very good. Very good. That sister that said hallelujah, please your mind. I beg you you have started this program all I want to encourage you is make sure you finish very very strong what swallow others will not swallow you in the name of Jesus say amen like a believer let your amen be louder than nah. very good very good very good praise the name of the Lord I want to share a testimony with you then I will now ask you to do something. Beloved, look up and look at me. In case you are privileged to follow any man of God that you are sure that is from the Lord, there are times to tap from their grace. That you are following them bomber to bomber does not guarantee you tapping into their grace. You can follow a pastor for 10 years, 20 years without that anointing that he carry. Doing anything good in your life. You must connect to it. And when once you connect to it, it will begin to flow. Praise the name of the Lord. There was at a point I get into a life I was like, God I can't follow Pastor Chooks and be struggling. Somebody say error. <laughs> I didn't hear you say error. Listen to me, sir. I said it during crossover. When you find yourself in a progressive church and you are not making progress, it means there is something you're supposed to be doing that you are not doing. And I discover one terrible thing in MFM. MFM pastors, they don't teach members how to do the right thing. Mostly when it comes in the area of seed sowing. Some pastors don't want to talk about it. You know why? Because they don't want people to look at them as somebody that is looking for money. No. What is the testimony? Sometimes last year, 
I invited pastor in our place and as we were preparing for that program I made up my mind that I want to do something that will make him happy I take time to gather seed, real seed I will not tell you to figure after the program I carried the seed I saw it into his life and he made a statement he said Francis as from today whatever that is happening in LMA church will begin to happen in this your place I said amen he said as from today the way LMA church used to feed up people will be outside you will begin to have overflow I said amen to cut the long story short after that prayer two months later we discover that the church become too small. We put the first two canopy. A month later, we put it another two, making it four. It got to a point we increase it to six. Beloved, the church has blown like wildfire. Why? Because I made up my mind to make a man of God happy, so that I can do what I can tap into the grace. If you get to that place, I will bless you tomorrow, you will see grace. It's not it's grace. Somebody shout grace. grace. I can't hear you. Somebody holler grace. grace. We are already in the morning. Yesterday, I was talking with him on phone and I asked him, I said, Pastor, what is your prayer point? <laughs> he said, my prayer point. I said, yes, sir. What is your prayer? What do you want God to do for you? And he said, Francis, my need is not much. Oh, I just want God to complete this children church so that I can rest a little. I said, how much are you looking for? He said, 10 million and above, plus or minus, before we spend something like 10 million and above, we roof the place. We must have just one or two things. They have already drawn the wire. The work is going on. But I want to pray for those of you that have been contributing towards that project. Can I pray for you? Are you ready to say amen? Anywhere your children go to, they will find favor. Did you hear what I said? Because you believe in that project, wherever your children find themselves, they will find favor in the name of Jesus. If you are living as a tenant, may God miraculously build your house in the name of Jesus. If you have your own house already, may God build you an estate in the name of Jesus. Now, the man of God did not ask for anything for himself. All he wants is for that place to be completed. And I understand because when you have this kind of project, all your mind, even when you are dreaming, you find yourself in that place. That is how it works. Now, what I want to say now is for me and some of you, there is a grace I want to connect to as pastor is returning back from this trip. I want to connect to a grace. Number one, grace that I will be using dollar to sow seed. Yes. I, it has it. I want to be sowing seed in Naira, in dollar. It's possible. Somebody say it's possible. Number two, grace. It is grace that I should be traveling to America the way it's going to America. It's just moving. Pia, 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 pia. I look like for Jesus. You cannot have an international pastor and live a local life. I pray for you. Even if you never dream of going to abroad before, may God open the door for you in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Raise your voice. May international door open for you in the name of Jesus. Lord, raise your voice. For the last time, God open international door for you in the name of Jesus. Now, beloved, to as many of you that want us to connect into that grace, I have programmed something on ground. I didn't tell him. 
If you see him asking, as pastor is stepping his feet in this church, I want us, I want him to pray for us. Just two things. Number one, Father, as from today, let this my children begin to spend dollar. Number two, Father, let the door of international opportunities begin to open for them. Are you saying amen like a believer? That is why I want to beg you. Number one, please make sure you are available. Wait for this poem of changes. After the poem of changes, just wait for the one hour prayer before. Let it be that as it's coming down, it should speak into our life. That is how to connect grace. What we need to do, let's make him happy. Let's make him what? When you surprise a man of God, you provoke the anointing inside of him to say what ordinarily he wouldn't have said. So I want us to provoke the anointing because when we drop seed concerning this project as a surprise to him, you will see him smiling. If you believe, say I believe. If you want to be part of what I'm saying as we go, you can give 10,000, I'm not calling big money, it's just seed is going to that building. Come. Come. Very fast. I don't have time. 10,000 seeds. Come. All of you come. I will count us. All of us. As pastor is landing, I will make sure he pray for us. Come. Some of you have given him millions now. He told me some of you have. 10,000. Come. If you are coming, come. It's not a vow. We are dropping the money today. We gather it and tell him whatever that he can reach concerning this thing, it is our contribution. Manage it, but pray for us. Let our own door of international opportunity to open. If you are coming, please come very fast. No time. Wherever you find yourself, come fast. No time. You can run. I'm going to give you number. So when once I call for the prayer, you join me in pastor's office. Anytime I call for that prayer, make sure you join me in pastor's office. I hear. I hear. Good. If you are coming, come with the money, we drop it there. It's a surprise. Let's give him a surprise. Amen. Let's give him a surprise. That is how to connect to grace. Don't just pray, 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 pray. Some of you, you just believe in this prayer, prayer. Prayer is good. But when you want to move to another level, you press more, you sow seed. You press more, you sow seed. If you are sir, yeah. sir. Sir. Thank you, sir. Sacrifice. Sacrifice. Uh, prayer, prayer, prayer. Yes. Sister, open your eyes. Take your number. Sister, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. If you are coming, come. You put, I, listen to me. Nobody will kidnap you because of 10,000. 10,000 a month. So if I come, they will kidnap. Nobody. You know, they. What, they are not, nobody is looking for 10,000 to carry somebody. If you are coming, come. Join us. Jo, you will, I, I don't like talking too much when you come in the house. Listen to me. I did one Ususu this year. You know what they call Ususu in, in worry? Contribution. All those daily contribution. I gathered the whole money, about 1.4 million. Did I collect the money, sir? The Holy Spirit asked me to carry the money and sow into the church project. I look my wife. I look the money. I look my wife again. I look the money. I didn't know how to say it because the money is with her. I do three days dry. Go to talk to her. I carry the money like that. I put it there. But there are some things that has happened since I did that. That that is more than money. You know, there are some gifts that is more than money. That, huh? Some things that has happened that is more than money in that church. But some people who doesn't know the secret, they are just saying, eh, hey, just we don't know what he's using. Now so that they wear white, white, white. Go show your own white in the market. Buy where. Stop talking nonsense. God will help us in Jesus' name. Should I bring it down for them? 
He want to join with 5,000, come. Oh yeah, come. I want us to go and rest. If you want to join with 5,000, come. Now, as you're coming, what we do is don't transfer. Just come with the money, okay? We draw it. It's not big money. It's small money. Well, immediately I called you. Just come to pastor's office. We drop it. And pastor will pray for us. But before you go, ask God for something. Ask. Ask for. Ask, please, sister, ask something. Ask for something. Ask. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Father, you are the same God that brought money out of the mouth of a fish. That makes you a mysterious God. Father, we want to pay a surprise package visit to your servant as a return on this trip. That I don't know what I have asked for. How big it is. Father, please for them to know that indeed that any man that gives a cup of water to a prophet will receive the prophet reward. Daddy, please, whatever they have asked, let each and every one of them Receive it double in the name of Jesus. As from today, any good thing they used to use money to do in life, you will have them in the name of Jesus. Shame, embarrassment, the lack of money can cause. I might not you from such in the name of Jesus. goes to children's church your children go we take them higher in the name of Jesus above all all the days of your life you will never experience anything called death in the life of your children in the name of Jesus it is well with you Go and come back with your testimony. The name of God, the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, El Shaddai. Jesus' name we pray. Go back to your seat. God bless you. You are blessed. Say, amen. you are blessed. You are blessed. Later, sir. Not now. Don't drop it now. Don't drop it in this hotel. Please. We we'll drop it together after the prayer. Somebody shout hallelujah. I want you to go and rest. When are we starting prayer or change hands? Time. You are not talking. Time. 7 a.m. Jesus time. I beg you, don't miss that power more change hands. Stand on your feet, everybody. Say Jesus. I can't hear you. Say Jesus. Say that I say Jesus. Appear in my dream. Say it louder and I say Jesus. Raise your voice now and say Jesus. Appear in my dream. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray.
in Jesus mighty name we pray can I pray for you before you go and sleep anybody that carries sound to place curse on you I command that curse back fire in the name of Jesus please let your amen be very loud anybody that naked herself himself to curse you I command that curse break in the name of Jesus any other crying against you let that other be silenced in the name of Jesus I stand on this altar to rebook every altar that is crying against you and I decree every altar demanding for your worship every altar saying you must serve me let that order God's word in the name of Jesus altar that has swallowed what will make you great in life if you are ever carry anointing let them vomit it vomit it in the name of Jesus like daughter battle every like father like some battle that is confronting you if you are ever swallowed out of your neighbor let that battle end tonight in the name of Jesus tomorrow I pray for you somebody say I receive any battle that enter your life in the night this is night as you shout seven powerful amen, let that battle end tonight in the name of Jesus. Every couple of spirits that they are using to monitor you. God's way in the name of Jesus. tonight with the blood of Jesus any power that wants to come and attack you because of this prayer Holy Ghost I can't hear you Holy Ghost Holy Ghost Holy Ghost Holy Ghost let that fire consume them in the name of Jesus the Lord bless you from Zion I can't hear you. Amen. Cause is where to shine upon you. May the Lord be gracious unto you. Even now and forevermore. The grace, let's go. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God. Surely. I can't hear you. As you shout three powerful amen. Those of you that want to drop your seed of any kind, come to pastor's office. I, I hear one, three, heaven shaking and leaving. I want to go. Let's go. Huh? I can't hear you. Tell somebody, I will hear your testimony. Tell another person, I will hear your testimony. Somebody, I will testify. See you 7 a.m. Jesus time. God bless you.